Hello pastors! Sana nawa po ay tuloy-tuloy ang ating gawain sa ating mga iglesia. Now, we want to share with you some more practical tips on how to make effective presentations online. Number one, build your media team. Kung wala pa po tayong media team, this is an opportunity for us to create one right now. There might be individuals and young people in the church na maari po nating i-involve to get the body moving and participating in online platforms. They can share thoughts, ideas, devotions that could go out online. Number two, audio check. Siguraduhin po natin na maayos ang ating audio. Siguraduhin po natin na maayos ang ating audio. Siguraduhin po natin na maayos ang ating audio. If our audio isn't good and we sound like we're speaking from a tube or a can, people will not stay for long. Sometimes it's best to record in a small room to minimize the echo. Number three, pleasing background. Look for a place in your home with a presentable or pleasing background. Take a picture of yourself and your background and adjust it until it looks pleasing. There may be some items there that you need to remove. Check and remove these unwanted items like chairs or laundry, phone bills, whatever is looking there until you come up with a pleasing background. Next, be sure that you have good lighting. This source would most likely come from a nearby window or your room lights, but be sure that it's not too bright or not too dark. It needs to be well lit. Be consistent on all your online platform updates. Maybe you can share brief updates of what's happening with you, announcements at the church, or some good news. But make sure that it is posted regularly. At least three times a week would be good. You can share announcements, photos, quotes, some encouraging devotional thoughts on your online platforms. Review your videos. After you have shot it, go back and check it, have a look-see, make sure that what you want to communicate is clearly communicated. Also, check out what others are doing. Not to copy them, but to get ideas. We can be more creative in how we can engage our viewers and those that connect with us online. Maybe you can talk to other pastors or other leaders in your network to find more ideas. Yun, napakadali. We hope that these tutorials will help you get going on your online campaigns. If you have other questions, please comment below or send us a message so we could provide more tips and advice on how to improve our online ministry. Again, we encourage you to multiply God's message wherever you are.